It's the first time tuning in. My name is Ron Johnson. What I talk about is my Aquarians behind me, well-being, mental health, and how to get those two together because that's critical in developing resiliency and overcoming challenges. So today is going to be a special video where I talk about three websites that I go to actually to buy my monster fish. Well, first thing is that I always like to buy my fish locally if I can from a local supplier or a mom and pop store. But often enough, what I'm looking for, they don't have because most people don't have the tank size or the time or just to, the energy to put it into having a monster fish or a rare fish. So often enough, I can't find them at my local hobby store. Um, what I tend to do is then go on Facebook market or not sorry, Facebook, Facebook groups to, to find actually my monster fish, which that's completely fine. But sometimes people don't have the fish I'm looking for, like sing rays or arapaimas or catfish, just to name a few. I then have to go online and find them. And that is a little more difficult because a lot of websites out there from eBay to you name it, selling fish. And sometimes it's a little sketchy to see why you know they're selling for just such a cheap price, which can be very small, or how they ship it. More importantly is obviously you want to go somewhere you can trust, and that's the key thing doing that. So what I tend to do is before I actually buy a fish is I do one thing, is I get an aquarium set up. So I always I already have a quarantine tank here. You guys can see where I can see, you know, you see a little tab that says water change. That's usually for my wife or people that come taking my aquariums. I'm not here to know what prime to put in there, what plugs to turn off, and how much the water level is used by blue tape. But more importantly, I always have a tank ready to quarantine my fish. That's gonna be critical in maintaining care and make sure you treat the fish. It's not about quarantining a fish is more important. What's about when you get a new fish is to make sure it eats right away. If you do have a fish shipped in, what can happen is that it can get nervous, it can get scared, it doesn't know what to eat. And by having a small tank, I get to monitor what food it eats. I get to monitor what is behavior and nocturnal. Does like the high, is it scared, is it sick? Those kind of things. So having a quarantine tank already set up is really critical in the care. So let's talk about the three websites that I go for. First website, you guys probably knew that, know them, is Predator Fins. So I like about their websites, it's very easy to shop, and if you simply just click right here where it says home, you see the current inventory, and you see actually what they have in stock. So, you know, often enough, they have a lot of variety of fish. Um, let's say, for example, me, I love stingrays, and this is kind of their top selection of fish. But if I like a stingray, I click on a stingray, it goes to the other website and, um, sorry, other page, and I can see what size it is, look at the pictures, and very easy to shop. I hit the home screen, I go to the top, there it is. And I got a couple of things already in my cart, but actually this is actually where it is, up top to the right-hand corner. It's actually where you actually see the fish itself. So what tends to happen next is what's good about Predator fans, I'm going to tell you guys this, is one, they do 24-hour delivery. Two, easy shop and checkout. And three, how they ship it is key. They always double bag. It's always in a small box. When you ship it, you find it. It's very easy to take care of the fish. Often enough, never happened yet, cross my fingers, is that fish eat right away and they usually have no disease. So they really take good care of their fish. Let me show you the next website on my fish shop. This is another website I shop at. It's definitely in there. I think they're in Massachusetts last time I checked, but easy to shop. So let's say the same thing, go here. Let's say you want to buy our giant red tail grommy. There's the fish right there. You click on it, and you see there's three in stock. So they actually tell you what they have in stock. Unlike predator fins, they don't tell you what they have in stock. So this can be right or wrong, but very easy to shop. I hit add to the top right-hand side. You guys can see the drop-down menu of the fish actually in there. You click on it, and then I actually click on the cart itself. So let's click on the cart. And then I can see right here what the shipping fees are, and I can pretty much check out. So that's one of my second websites I always shop at. What's good about Exotic Fish Shop is at the bottom of the very page, let me show you guys at the bottom of the page. So at the bottom of the page itself, if you scroll down to the very bottom, is a number. So this is number, his name is Steve. You text him, he's going to respond. And what's good about texting Steve is that at he responds very fast. Like the other day, I got a fish from Steve. I asked him a couple of questions. He says, yes, we can ship. It's in stock. And he was able to ship my fish. So one thing things about Steve I like, Exotic Fish Shop. One, easy to contact and respond. Two, they have up-to-date stock. Three, they ship it in quality boxes. Fourth, as I never had issues with their fish. They usually arrive, they eat very well, and they never have diseases. So that's the other place I actually go and shop at as well is Exotic Fish Shop. Let's go into the third one I shop at. Third one 
It's called Global Fish Co. They have a lot of rare fish and pretty easy to shop. The drop down menu here to the left hand corner. You click where it says freshwater fish and say me, I love my stingrays. I click on stingrays and here are all the stingrays they have in stock. So if you're looking for some rare stuff, they got it. It was like a good about them, same process. You hit add to cart. There it is inside the cart. You hit view cart. And actually, what's good about them, if I can find it, you can pick your delivery day. So if I want to have it arrive a certain day, which it looks like it's blacked out right now, but usually you can pick the arrival day, and there it is, right there, Thursday will be the soonest possible day to arrive. What I like about them, three things I like about Global Fish Co. One, they respond well. Actually, all three of them respond really well. Two, when I order their fish, in, I never really have a problem with their fish. Three, is to eat fast, and that's the key. So it's always my three top three websites, Predator Fins, uh, Exotic Fish Shop, and obviously Global Fish Coat. All of them arrive very well, double bag. They always put it inside a box, inside the box of styrofoam, the fish is inside there. And if you can leave a little note on each one where it says, where might I want to have it shipped? If you say I live in a colder climate, please ship it with a, a heat pack and please ship it with some insulation. That's really good when I order their fish. So that's why I love going to those fish shops to order those. So top three websites, Predator Fins, Zark Fish Shop, and Global Fish Company. And the reason why I order from them, again, quality fish, never had an issue. And that's why you see all these monster tanks right around here behind me because I like ordering from them. Now, biggest tip always, go to a local hobby shop, Always buy fish from them. I like shopping, shopping and helping local businesses too. If you can't find there, look on Facebook, go to any group and ask questions. If you're looking for certain fish, you can post. Look for a certain fish and write it down. So I want you guys, if you guys like my videos, you like my content, please don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to hit the like button and don't forget to comment because I want to know where your shop your fish at. So again, thanks for listening. This is Ron Johnson, your fish enthusiast and mental health coach and soon to be a therapist. And thanks for listening. And don't forget to subscribe.